Hello all, welcome back to Hello PhD. This video is going to explain about what is Web of Science and what are all the Web of Science core collection and a demo for how to find SEA indexed journals. So watch this video till the end to get the complete detail. Also don't forget to subscribe Hello PhD for more research related information. Web of Science is an online subscription-based scientific citation indexing service originally produced by the Institute of Scientific Information that is ISI during the year 1964. This ISI was acquired by Thomson Scientific and Healthcare in 1994 and named Thomson Reuters Intellectual Property and Science Business. Later it became Thomson ISI. Now, it maintained by Clarivate Analytics to provide a comprehensive citation search of all indexes. The name of this overall database is called Web of Science Core Collection, which includes the major citation indexes such as Science Citation, Social Sciences, Arts and Humanities, and Emerging Sources Citation Indexing. If you want to know the difference between these indexings, I have written an article. Please refer it. The link is given in the description below. Due to the different indexing categories, many confusions were arisen to choose the right journal for the publication. The journals indexed under this database are considered to be the world's leading journals of science and technology because of the rigorous selection process. So let's see what are all the basic requirements to index into this web of science. First of all, it will be verified whether the journal follows the proper peer review process. Then it should follow the good ethical publishing practice and it should meet the technical requirements of the web of science and also the journal should have a good English language bibliographic information. Finally, it will be verified whether any web of science user has recommended this journal. If the journal has paused all this evaluation process, then it will be indexed in the ESE first. Then it will be monitored for the proper peer review process and consistency in the citation and other metrics then it will be ranked higher to SEIE. That's all about basic information about Web of Science core collections and different indexings. Let's jump into the demo to know how to find the SEIE indexed journal. Okay, let's go to Google and type three letters M J L. So MJL means it's master journal list, the place where all the Web of Science core collection journals are available. So click the first link, Web of Science master journal list. So this is the page you can browse, search and explore journals indexed in the Web of Science. So in this search bar, you can put the target journals ISSN number or title and you can search it. Okay, now I'm going to do this process in two ways. That is first I am going to select one target journal and I am going to identify whether the journal is indexed in Web of Science or not. In the second process, I am going to download one of the Web of Science core collection to select the appropriate journal for my publication. First I am going to select one target journal. I am just uh, typing. I am going to take one random journal. International journals in bio i'm just typed international journals in bioinformatics i'm going uh, from these tags i'm going to select one journal i'm just taking this one bio data mining i'll just take the first one bio data mining so i just open this journal i'm going to verify whether this journal is indexed in SEA. So here ISSN number is available. So I just copy it and I'll search it. So if this journal is indexed in Web of Science, it will show. So this journal Biodata Mining is available under the open access category in Web of Science core collection. The index is Science Citation Index Expander. If you want to know more information about this journal, you have to click this button. By clicking it, you will be asked to register or log in with uh, any of the social ID account. For example, if you have Facebook account, you can log in with Facebook or Google or LinkedIn or Orsid ID. I am going to log in with Orsid ID. I have already registered with that. So I am just. Okay, after you logged in, you will get the complete information about the journal. Like journal's website, 
journal's publisher's website and when it was first published issue per year and the country country of the journal and frequency how frequent the journal is publishing and more information you will get so in this way you can identify your target journal is indexed in the web of science core collection or not in the another method i am going to download one of the core citation index so these are all the four major citation index as i already explained science citation index expanded scie ssci and ahca and esca okay these are all the four major citation index under the web of science core collection i am going to download any one of this i am going to download scie and i am going to select one journal okay based on my manuscript i am going to select one journal from this database so after selecting it i am going to check the detail of the journal whether that particular journal is up to my manuscript or not the core collection list has downloaded in the csv format so these are all the journals available under the scie index so totally uh totally there are 9390 journals are available under the scie index journals under the web of science core collection category now i go into select one journal based on my preference So these journals are included from many research areas i am going to find a journal which is related to my research i am going to type i'll just remove it i have selected physics many uh, all the journals relevant to physics are appear here i'm going to select uh, i'm going to randomly take one issn number uh, i'm just taking this one i i copied it and again i'm going back to master journalist search and i put so the journal is available and i am going to see the complete detail about the journal the journal has four issues per year and uh, it publishes quarterly and i can go and search the journal's website as well i can read the author informations and uh, submission procedures if the journal is up to my manuscript and then i can proceed with that so in this two ways i can identify whether the journal is indexed in sci or not or else i can select the appropriate journal for my manuscript That's it. Hope this will help you to know more about Web of Science Core Collection and how to find the SCIE indexed journals. Please like and share this video. Also, don't forget to subscribe this channel for more research-related information. Thanks for your time. Thank you.